In the pursuit of goals and dreams and bettering yourself, it's of course important to focus on what you need to start doing to get you to where you want to be. But what most people don't consider actually is what they need to stop doing to get them to, the, to where they want to be. What kind of baggage do they need to let go of? What do they need to stop doing to, to get them to live more fully in their lives? This oftentimes is something more hidden. This is why people don't often consider it. So let's say you want a better relationship with your wife. Maybe you want to start saying I love you every day, but those I love you's won't mean anything unless you stop maybe perhaps nagging. So you need to start saying I love you, you need to stop nagging every day. That's equally as important, both of these things. Let's say you want to backpack across Europe, which is a big goal for a lot of people. It's important to start saving money, but how do you start saving money? There's something you need to stop doing there, obviously. What maybe in your life you're drinking every other day. What would happen if you stopped drinking every other day? You'd save a lot more money and you'd get to Europe a lot faster than you would otherwise. So oftentimes these are little things, but huge baggage that's holding you back from, from living your full potential. So it's oftentimes never considered in life, these tiny little things that are holding you back. So I ask you to sit and reflect on what you need to stop doing to get you to where you want to be in life and live more fully as a result.